Good morning, good morning, good morning. Let's just pull your energy real quick. I'll be back later with my raw loves and stuff, guys. Uh, just got a busy, a busy schedule. And uh, taking care of me, okay? I love you guys, though. I love, I love you guys. Daily energy, daily energy. Give or take a day or two. Give or take a day or two. You got the chariot. You got the chariot. And then you got the seven of fire at the bottom of the deck. And then the star. Okay, so something important, some type of achievement in order to move forward. It's also self-discipline, willpower. It's also public rec recognition, okay? Um, but somebody here, it, it's like a face-off, okay? Because what is with these face-offs? Um, somebody here is definitely needs to stand in their belief on making a certain decision, standing their ground, choosing their battles wisely, you know, picking and choosing um, for sure. So it, something's coming at you. And it looks like it's coming at you quick, but we got one energy that's no joke, okay? Ooh, two sevens, too. I just noticed that, okay? So, again, this is about getting on your life path. No matter what this is concerning right now, this has to do with your life path and, and, and getting on it, all right? Yeah, whoever this is for, you got two people flying in the air, okay? Um, so, this is bound for you guys to, I almost said butt heads. So you're button heads with somebody, whether it's a work situation, a lover situation. <laughs> Daily energy. Give it, take a day or two. Okay. I got the hermit. So it's just introspect. What you're thinking about, where are you going to go? What are you going to do? How are you going to do this? Soul searching. But you are, somebody already knows. It, to me, it's, it's definitely time to get out of hermit mode. Okay? We got the king of swords here. We got the queen of cups. And we got the five of pents. So with this five of pents, somebody's struggling to, to make a move. Contemplating in their head. Going nuts. Back and forth. Back and forth. Energy. It's like they feel like it's hazardous. Like big caution sign. Red flags. You know? Um, we have somebody right now that's very, likes to use their intuition. And then we got somebody else that's all about making the right practical, logical decisions for sure. Okay. Um, so the two of you, you're both carrying the sevens again. Okay. Somebody's bound to come out of hermit mode here. A, a conversation's going to be had. I, the, the, I mean, there's no way, there's no way around it. You're colliding. You're butting heads. It, it's, you know. I mean, it's, it could be one of those things too, where it's like you could just be out and about, and you bump into this person that obviously you're gonna butt heads with, and that's it. Why? Because you're supposed to. You're supposed to be bumping heads right now. You're supposed to be figuring this out. Um, so it could be, you know, somebody messages you, somebody comes by, you bump into somebody. I mean, it's definitely something like that. But somebody's definitely standing their ground. I don't know which of the two it is. Tell me about this Queen of Cups. Queen of Cups. I'm fascinated by your love bomb. We got the Two of Pence. Okay. This Two of Pence in this deck throws me. Because I can't tell. This, this is the one the other day where it was talking to me. It's like it, she's still, she's juggling something. I think they're going towards it, you know, really contemplating. Because this side, it's, it's almost like somebody's entertaining people to not, you know, to face something. It's something like that. But here it's just like, okay. 
I need to be smart. You know, it's one of those things for me. Tell me about the two of pence. Well, that's too many. Tell me about the two of pence, two of pence. Again, too many. Two of pence, two of pence. What's up with this queen of cups? Two of pence, two of pence. Um, wow. Look at that green in the bowl. I mean, it's the moon card, but this is somebody effing knows. She, I mean, she uses, this card is intuition, okay? But holy does she use her intuition. I mean, look at them both sitting in water. That says a lot. So I don't know if she's juggling love life, career, I'm not quite sure. But she's, she's not drowning in the water anymore. She's, she's solid. Whoever this queen of women is, woo-wee. Yeah, she's juggling. You know, I think because it's going towards the unknown. But she's, she's totally okay with that. You know, to me, she's, she's grounded. She's solid. You know, she's not putzing around. She's not being a jokester. She's, she's taking action. She, to me, she's grounded. I mean, that's, that's solid. Solid. I don't know if she's waiting on, you know, something to come out. You know, but I mean, it, it's, it's a crab in its shell, but it's floating. She's not hiding on this side. You're just dealing with, oh, this seems to be a love partner too, with the two dogs. Okay. Um, it's just the opposites, but I mean, she's, she's solid. She's working with the moon is what she's doing. This is not saying like. The secrets. It's not about the unknown. She knows something. I mean, look at this. Look at that. And look at the green in the bowl. Uh, oh, hello. I haven't seen this card come out yet. This is gorge. Okay, let's find out what this King of Swords is up to. What's going on with the King of Swords? King of Swords. I mean, this could be somebody battling their own brain moving forward, too, because you could have somebody in this particular situation that's super stubborn and not wanting to move, okay? Um, but it, to me, it really feels like two different energies, and then when I pulled on them, it was two different energies, so it only makes sense that it is, okay? Um, it's the Temperance and the Page of Cups, Okay. So something needs to be healed. Somebody's not acknowledging something. Someone's not trying to balance something out. Okay, so this person at one point, this this page, the King of Swords, had his back turned, kind of in dark energy. But now, you know, hey, I got some feelings. I want to move forward. But not quite really sure on how to do it. You know, um... And I think that's why it's going to be one of those situation where you guys are kind of button heads. Okay. Um, but you both carry the sevens. You both carry a major arcana. One's a ki king. One's a queen. You know. <sighs> Someone's tired. Somebody needs to change their perspective a wee bit. I don't know which one it is. Tell me about the hermit real quick. Or you could be dealing with a Virgo, but tell me about the hermit. I think you just, this hermit to me, and I never look at the hermit this way. I think you're just dealing with somebody who's stubborn or you're very stubborn. Tell me about the hermit. What's up with the hermit? It's the king of pence. This is somebody who's solid. Okay, so... To me, it looks like somebody changed their perspective. That's for sure. Going after, you know, reaping what they sow. So, eventually this is going to come together, whatever this is, if you're not already dealing with it. Okay, it is, I mean, that's a solid person right there. Whether it's male or female. So, or... Or there could be a woman here dealing with two men. Okay. And possibly even three. A Virgo, a Cap, or an Aquarian. 
Oh, I can't. Uh, but regardless with that, you know, this is just to me saying this person soul searched. You know, but again, we still have somebody just kind of like not really taking action though. But is that that's not going to last like that. It just, it won't. Colliding energy. You know what I'm saying? Y'all know what I'm saying? I love you guys. I'll see you soon. Bye.